Shoot. Okay, there we go. <laughs> no, uh, nothing went wrong. It's fine. Hey, guys. Uh, oh, sorry. I mean... I... I mean... <sighs> hey, guys. What's up? Uh... You all didn't think I could stay away for that long, did you? And on this national holiday... Nah, man. I had to come back. This is an important day today, if you're unaware. It is 420, aka Wheat Day, the most important holiday. Uh, it's known worldwide. It's a worldwide renowned holiday. Um, hold on, I gotta take another hit. Ch 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 <sighs> yeah, that's the good stuff. This is the only, the only day it's legal during all in all uh, states. Welcome, weed. <laughs> Welcome, weed sauce. Uh, <laughs> how are you doing this fine day? <laughs> Um, let me turn on some good tunes to get lit to. Uh, here we go. Uh, a nice little recreation of one of my old, uh, older songs. Dopamine. Yeah. Uh, I can see myself doing about 50 blunts, uh, listening to this song. <laughs> um... And we're doing, uh, my, sorry, you know, drugs and all that. I can't think straight. Uh, <laughs> 40 in. Hey, that's good. That's good. Hey, 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 um, now, I, kn I know we're all familiar with, um, you know, Minecraft and Meta7, uh, the two don't mix well, is what I'm trying to say. So, you know, as per tradition, I busted out the old, the old, um, I'm using a PNG now. What's up, guys? What's up? It's a new PNG. Whoa. I'm. If you look closely, uh, you might notice I have a blunt sticking out of my tooth there. Uh, is a nice little uh, something for the occasion, so to speak. I I'm gonna move it around as, a, as if. Uh, uh. Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, it's me. It's Jelly Bean here. I'm doing a little bouncy thing when I talk. Uh, let me do like a little close up. Hey guys. You can't see the chat now, can you? Uh huh. <laughs> Weed! Yeah. Oh, wait. Let me say that more expression. Weed! Anyways. Oh, I, don't you love how the way that that song looped? That was wonderful. Anyways. Uh, yeah. Admire this for a few seconds, because now it's gone. Uh, we're, we're over here now. Just kidding, we're over here. Um, and yeah, we got, we got Minecraft set up. Um... Stop, stop me for a second. This is serious. We need to be serious for a second. Um, I've been told... Okay, so a bit of context. Uh, so, uh, so okay. So, I, I think I've mentioned this before. Uh, there was this situation... Um, with, uh, with, with, uh, basically, 
Mojang unbased uh, wanted all of the Minecraft users to migrate their uh, Mojang accounts to Microsoft. Uh, I, however, could not do that because um, I use my mom's email, which she no longer has access to because it's from a defunct website. Uh, point is, I couldn't use my old account. Uh, so I basically had to buy Minecraft again. Uh, which is only like $27, but like I'm broke, so like that's a lot for me. But anyways, uh, so basically I'm doing this under a quote-unquote new account, but it's the same, it's me, it's the same thing, and nothing, nothing really changed. But anyways, I'm saying all this to say, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm getting all these, like, notifications of, like, um... Like, uh, what do you call it? Uh, achievements. I'm getting ach or advancements, whatever they're called. And I got Spooky Scary Skeleton. Uh, and that's all I wanted to point out. I just thought that was funny. Funny little joke. Oh, shoot. Uh, this is not a good play. <laughs> um, this is not the world I, I meant to go to. But we can make this work. Basically, uh, the idea for this stream, uh, well, I mean, obviously, we're, you know, we're playing Weedcraft, that's fairly obvious. But the, uh, the, the idea here, the main idea, uh, so to speak, is that we're just gonna have fun, we're just gonna build stuff, you know? I am currently running two mods, one is World Edit, the other is Optifine, you can see, you know, uh, okay, that one doesn't work, um, did, uh, did, uh, does this one work? Yes, it does. I don't know how to undo that, okay. Well, it doesn't matter, um, so we have World Edit, um, I guess Optifine just doesn't work, that's fine. It says that's Optifine, actually. Uh, what do you have to say about that? Uh, what happens if I... Okay, it didn't have any effect. Um, yeah, uh, this is... Okay, so I thought that this this was like an empty world that I wasn't using. This is actually... Let me... Hold on. Yeah, sorry. Let me get the tunes back in. Anyways, uh... Yeah. So, the, so, yeah, this is essentially an older world, um, which has now since been abandoned, so I guess it's kind of okay that uh, we'll be messing around in here, it doesn't, doesn't really matter. Essentially, this is what, um, when I was making like that first draft of, of, uh, of, of Epicaw City, or, oh, shoot, Odd Aesthetic, yeah, y'all remember that. When I was first making the webcomic, is <laughs> yeah, it's Lean World. Uh, welcome, Fancy Pantsy. Oh, it's actually Ada. Welcome, Ada. I haven't seen you in uh, a long time. Oh, I'm not gonna get no near those people. That's gonna lag my game. But yeah, when I was first making that uh, webcomic, um, this was basically just like a map that helped me to uh, kind of know where things are located and stuff. Which, looking back on it, uh, it's pretty cool, but this isn't exactly how Epica will look. Um, I mean, it'll look pretty similar. I but um, once I actually get around to making it, because there is another Minecraft world where I do actually have like kind of an Epica city setup. It's made to look more like uh, like Shibuya like, an actual existing city, uh, instead of just a bunch of random shapes <laughs> meshed together. Uh, but anyways, I guess we can do a little tour while, uh, while we wait for some people to show up. Uh, cause, you know, we need a lot of chat interaction. I'm basically just gonna be building whatever people tell me to. Uh, here's a fun, uh, little thing. Uh, so... It not only was this made so that I, uh, for the, uh, the webcomic, but I was also trying to make an animated adaptation of the, uh, the pilot episode. Um, and essentially, for all of the, like, 
parts where I needed like location in the background, which was a, f a few places. Uh, there, there's some pigs here and a fish. Cool. Uh, we're gonna take that. <laughs> I got a recipe. But yeah, like. Excuse me. To try and um, accurately convey what uh, happened. <coughs> Sorry. Um, to try and accurately convey what happened. Essentially, there's like a. This is like kind of where the story starts. It's not where the story starts now. I changed the way it begins, but. Originally, it started. Jakku was up here, he was doing his whole speech. Uh, then the owner of the of the business that of the roof that he's on top of he's like hey can you stop doing that and he's like no and then he gets angry he turns into the Hulk basically and they ch chase after him so yeah so essentially what happened you might notice these arrows here what I did was I basically uh, I think it was from here I did like a little recording yeah, I recorded it, and then I, I, I just moved around like this, basically backwards, right? And then I took a bunch of screenshots of that video, and I essentially just rotoscoped uh, <laughs> the buildings. <laughs> uh, which, it looked pretty janky, uh, but, but if I were to kind of like show kind of how it went. So basically, there's like an explosion here, Jakku jumps out. Lands on this little area here, skedaddles uh, uh, over this way, does a little slide there. Runs over here. Uh, jumps on, uh, this is meant to represent like a wire, like a little telephone wire. Uh, so he grabs onto it, he slides this way. Oh, no, we don't want to get stuck. He comes up here. And this part is where it really went, went wrong. So he lands up here. There wasn't really a point to that. He could have just, you know, gone that way, but whatever. Um, he comes here. Uh, I think he like falls down the stairs or something and then he gets back up as he's running. Or, no, I think it might've been something else. I don't quite remember. No, that's right. Uh, he did, yeah, so I think he fell down the stairs and then he came over here and I did it from this perspective. And then, uh, he did like a, yeah, he fell and then he tumbled this way and then he did like a big jump as like the camera panned over here. And then he like, essentially was like in free fall, like he was in the air for a second and then he falls down here, but the camera stationary doesn't follow him anymore. And then uh, the guy like bursts out of the wall or something. And that was like the only part of that pilot that I had like pretty much completed animation for. Or I guess, you know, I never like colored it or anything, but I did like all the line art and stuff and it took a while, but it actually looked pretty okay. Uh, I might release that to the public one day. I don't know. And then I think uh, the rest of the arrows is basically meant to just direct the action further. Obviously there was more to the scene. Um, but that's about as far as I planned. And then we get over here, and this will make more sense if you've read that uh, that first draft of the webcomic. I, I call it the first draft. It was meant to be the final product, uh, but I just don't like... I, I, I wasn't happy with it, so... Ended up cutting it. Uh, but anyways... If I could recap the story, he basically, he like goes, there's, he doesn't climb up any stairs. I don't know why I put those there. I guess so he can get up here later. Somehow he encounters this area with like this wall. Uh, wait, uh, there it is. There's the wall. Uh, but, uh, then he does a thing. The, the wall opens. I'm not explaining it for, uh, very well. He goes inside, it's like a secret laboratory or something, and then, uh... This was gonna be the, the whole underground facility. Not really underground, though, it's like, kind of above ground, actually. 
Um, I think because there was not a lot of underground to work with, that's why. Also, yeah, don't ask what this is. I was just messing around over here <laughs> for no reason. Yeah, anyways, I guess that's it for, like, war. Unless y'all want to see the Tomo... You know what, we'll explore the Tomo later. Let's get the building stuff. Let's... Oh. <laughs> yeah, okay. This was definitely based on Shibuya. This area here. But as you can see, it's very different. Uh, the current quote-unquote canon version. Uh... <gasps> looks more, I guess, real, so it, it looks better, is what I'm trying to say. The architecture, I mean. Because the architecture I have here, it like kind of makes sense in real life, but it's like, still really, uh, I don't know, just, just, just all kinds of messy and stuff. I'm gonna see what kind of, what kind of blocks. Favorite little my uh, classic medicine and color combination. Uh, I get oh, uh, since we are doing a weed thing, I think it would make sense if we uh maybe contribute to that a little bit. Um, we're just gonna make a little thing here. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. Alright, cool. Yes. I I'm I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. Oh yeah, that's nice. Add one up here. Oh yeah, look at that, baby. That's what I'm talking about right there. Could you just imagine being on this side just gonna like Oh yeah. <laughs> I should mention I've never uh smoked weed. In my life, I I don't even know how how you smoke. I th I'm pretty sure you just inhale at one end of the blunt, and that's how it works. I don't even I don't even know why fire comes out of it. Welcome, hyper, uh, I infinite Saturn. Uh, uh, ch 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 happy weed day. <laughs> it's going great, dude. You just missed like a whole lore <laughs> spiel. Uh, well, it's okay. I know, you know, most people w probably w uh, wouldn't have understood it anyways. It kind of requires a lot of context. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, Minecraft is very laggy on my, uh, on my PC. Thus, I'm using a PNG today. Welcome, Break Time Timber. How are you? Um, this is a little bit different from like the normal PNG that I usually use to like represent uh, my model. Um, I don't know. I the main reason is when I was drawing this picture, I couldn't quite get the hair to look nice, like the normal hair I normally have, where it's like the yeah, y'all know the hair. So I just decided I would base this more on uh, Watashi. Which is a, a character that I made up, which is kind of meant to represent more like the real life me rather than like the VTuber persona me. Um, complete with like the actual hairstyle that I have IRL. Um, anyways, we are in, um, what, what did Tree Sauce call it? Lean World? I, I call this place Weed World, honestly, because it's, um, you know, it's gr it's green like the uh, the classic. Uh, I forgot what I was gonna say. <laughs> what do you, uh, what is another word for weed? I I forget what what like drugs are. <laughs> I don't know the the drug lingo. Whoa! I'm gonna kill this person. <laughs> oh, that's that does ah uh, whatever. <laughs> I'm leaving that in. Get edited, bro. Oh, I've also got world edit on. We can literally build anything. By the way, 
Um. Woo. <laughs> Lean and green. Simple, simple. Oh, we should make. Yes. Okay. Wait. I got. I got it. I got. I got. I got the perfect thing. Wait a minute. What is that? What? Oh yeah, that's for the uh, the Zodiac peep, uh, the the Zodiac uh, group, which you guys d definitely don't know about yet. That that is like season three stuff right there for odd aesthetic. Oh yeah, you know what? Uh, I was gonna say this before I forgot. I'm I'm just so high. That's that's all. That's that's what it is. Um, but but uh, I was coming up with fun little little names for everyone. Little <laughs> little weed names. <laughs> uh, so tree sauce is weed sauce. Uh, I need names for everyone else. Hyper Infinite Saturn. You can be. <laughs> I don't know what's a good, what's a good one. This is why I need to know what what are the other words for weed. I don't know. I don't know. Just uh, hyper weed finance Saturn. There we go. And then we also got weed time timber. It's not very creative. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> Look at that. Lean, lean, lean. Yeah. <laughs> Glorious names, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, oh no, no, you know what we need? Yes, dude, that's great. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is making somebody mad. <laughs> I know this is gonna peeve someone off. How dare you? That is a drug. You cannot, you cannot make light of drugs. Uh, okay, dude. Uh, well, I'm the one with the lean cup, and so you know, <laughs> look who's the 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 boss now. Oh, I just need another. Okay, there we go. Um. <laughs> hey, 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 what are you talking about? What are you talking about? Did you see how slow that, hold on, that was, what are you talking about? Okay, um, I, I guess I'll spare you for now. No one would know if you perished. <laughs> oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Wait a minute. Keep forgetting I have world at it. Man, building this place would be so much easier if I knew what world edit was back then. Actually, I did know what world edit was when I built this. I just didn't know how to install it. Um, let's build the li the library of Alexandria. I don't. Uh, let's not go there. Let's not go there. Too laggy. Too laggy. Um. Okay, dude, uh, cool. <laughs> Let's go back to the, this place. <laughs> Why did I spawn so many villagers? Okay, we're gonna build the Library of Alexandria. Yo, <laughs> y'all ready for this? <laughs> this is gonna be great. Okay, <laughs> you, you aren't ready for this. Um, hold on, I'm gonna make it like a perfect cube. Uh, that's pretty good, all right. That's probably symmetrical. Okay, and then 
Actually, uh, no, uh, yeah, it doesn't really matter. It's already a wooden floor. Um, let's do something different. Yeah, yeah, let's go with, you know, netherrack isn't really used for, like, floors that much. <laughs> so I think it would be cool if we used that. Um... Hmm, where is the, uh, doors? It's in redstone, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, I'll do like, uh, I, I, this will be fine. All right. Uh, now this does, you know, resemble the Library of Alexandria. Uh, let's just, you know, I think we should do something a little different, you know, if you know what I mean. Uh, me, like. You know, like, maybe make it a little bit more accurate. Oh no, I locked myself in. Uh, yeah, I'm thinking something like this might be a good bit of a <laughs> Now that's what I call the Library of Alexandria. Uh, it's historically accurate. Question, why is there... Wait, oh, when is there ever an opportunity to use the why is the audio sound redeem? Like, there's never a time. <laughs> okay, uh, okay, I'll be fully transparent. <laughs> I blazed it. You're so right. This is the 420 library. Okay, look, I'm, I'm gonna explain it. Why doesn't the door burn down? <laughs> okay. Um... All right, listen. Long ago, this is, a, this is a great tale. So I'm actually gonna build something while I explain it. It's it's a basically it's a what do you call it? Like a running gag. It's an inside joke. That's basically what it is. Weed logs two six six nine. Weeds in faha. Haha, <laughs> funny number. I'm forgetting. With that, which I can't even read that. I don't even know what that's supposed to say. Okay, but bottom line is there was this YouTuber named Charmex. It was a bit of bit of a bit of a legend, as they call him. Um, he used to do uh, these reaction videos, right? to these videos called YTPs. I don't know if you've ever heard of that. It's basically like what a remix is, but for like videos. So like, it, you know, if you've ever seen like those funny little edits of like videos where like uh, maybe it'll take something that someone said and then like mix it around or it'll um... Oh, you know what those, those are, okay. But yeah, so basically he did a lot of reactions to those type of videos. Um, and I happen to be one of those people that did, that made those videos. Um, I used to do those. <clears throat> and I, well, I used to make YTPs of him, uh, cause, uh, of course, cause you know, he would react to it. And then that's like free publicity and stuff. That, that was kind of the main driving point and then i started like actually being creative with it but basically um yeah so my first ever ytp that he reacted to uh i believe it was called ytp charmex eats 250,000 jars of charmex which was another like joke based on like the actual channel but anyways Long story short, during his reaction, because the way that I made it was that I, um, you know, like screen recording with like a phone and stuff. I did, I used like phone screen recording. And, uh, so the audio was very, uh, not good. So basically, <laughs> during his reaction, he says the phrase, and I quote, why is the audio that's what he says and then that that's like what the the audio clip is <clears throat> but anyways that's like kind of like a running 
or not a running gag, so I don't make jokes of it anymore. But it's like a, yeah, that, that's what it is. It's basically like an inside joke. Uh, anyways, here he is right now. It's Charmix. Look at him. Oh yeah, he has like a little uh, skull uh, shirt and uh, beanie. So I'm gonna put that there. There we go. It's an amazing story. Yeah. It's very, it's very nostalgic for me, I'd say. Because my whole uh, channel revolved around that guy at some point. Uh, and, then, and, then he, and then he stopped reacting to me. And then he quit YouTube, so uh, there goes that. But yeah. Um, now what should I build? Um... I'm not gonna lie, I was half expecting to say you screen recorded and then you didn't edit yourself saying why is the audio out? Oh! <laughs> that would be kind of funny. Uh, I made so many, like, mistakes back then. I... <clears throat> you know, sometimes I'll go back and, like, watch my older videos, but, like, those, like, YTP edits, I hate them. I can't, I cannot... Stand it. I can't I can't watch th through my older videos at least on my own if I was doing like a like a watch party thing like on stream Which I have done before of like my older videos. I might do it again sometime, but um, You know I, I, Unless it's in that context where it's like you're watching it with people Is it I would never go back and watch it on my own because I can't stand them it's, it's brittle with so many mistakes. Like, imagine hearing the video poster say, Why does this suck? <laughs> Why is the audio? Why is it not working? Yeah, no, it's definitely, it's like a common thing with creators. That's a little lamppost. I don't know why I made that. <laughs> Let's blaze it up. Yeah. That is completely useless because the, the light doesn't reach the ground. <laughs> you go to run and improve. That, you know what? You're right about that. Definitely right about that. No, I, you know, I'm pretty proud with where I am right now. I mean, uh, I'm good at art. I'd say like okay that that recent art I did of of, of Sonic I'm actually super proud of that because I think it looks really cool Bill built the most useless town yeah you know okay why does this look like that wait what wait what is the is there a light source here what I don't wait that is super weird why is it like that What? It's showing it like it's glowing, but there's no light source here. What is going on? And here as well. What is this? What? Where is this emulating from? Okay, well anyways, I, what I was gonna say is most of the city is really badly made from an infrastructure uh, standpoint. Why is the light source? <laughs> Why is the light source? I love that Sonic art and all your art, of course, it's rad. Thank you, yeah. I'm super happy with it. <gasps> Wait, oh, I just remember, you guys wanna see the old, the, the hospital scene? It's like right over here. Or the thing that I um, made so I can make the hospital scene. That, okay. Well, cause I was, tr when I was making that animated pilot, so, Okay, the idea was, so in this, in the scene, okay, I'll explain this much again, because uh, some people weren't here for it. Basically, I have this webcomic, right? It's called Autostatic. It's really, it's cool. Uh, I haven't actually made it yet, but I, tr I attempted to make it once, and it kind of sucks. Uh, but, but it's better now, and it's going to be cool. But anyways, uh, at some point, 
um, I made like essentially a rough draft for it for like the first episode, and then I never I never completed it because uh, I didn't like it. But <clears throat> I also tried to um, and basically make an animated like adaptation of like what would be the pilot episode or the first episode. Basically, what happens in the scene? The main character Jakku. Um, there's like this whole like superhero fight thing and he's like, ah, I'm out of here. And then you're like, wee. He essentially jumps off because his friend told him to. And then his friend comes in with like a robot mech and catches him and they fly off in this direction. But then the other guy can also fly and they're following them. And essentially there's like this scene. I have it so where, um, wait, can I go fast, please? Gotta go fast. Um, basically, I, I recorded like footage of me backing up in this, and then I like rotoscoped it to make it look like uh, they were doing a whole chase scene in the sky, but in a city. I don't know why I explained all that, but yeah. <laughs> that brings back memories. Oh yeah. Um, originally in the world of odd aesthetic, the way that the city worked was that it was split up. You had the rich over here and the poor over there, which is not how it works now. Um, well, it's similar, but it, it's not like so like obvious, I guess. Keep the beds outside the hospital at the, the dumb town design. <laughs> that would be cool. <laughs> um, Y'all want to explore the Tobomobile? This is... okay. Okay, well, we're not gonna look down there. We don't want all of that happening. Actually, you know what? Um... Is that... Okay. Um... Tab... Cool. <laughs> I just wanted to kill everyone real quick. Because they were bothering me. Why are you still alive? What? Okay, what? No? What? It doesn't kill the villagers? That's crazy. <laughs> Look at all those items I have. Oh no. The experience. Ah. Uh... I can't believe you guys are still alive. It really grinds my gears. Anyways, you guys want to see this, um, this piece of ship? Ha <laughs> ha! Or whatever. <laughs> Friend, you should jump, bro. Jack, okay, jumps. That is, like, like, kind of literally how that scene went. It was kind of dumb. <laughs> you was really just like, oh, well, Tomoko said too. I guess I should. You know what? Uh... Okay, yeah, let's do a vote. Do you guys want me to explore the ship or do you want me to uh, build more funny looking stuff? Why is the thing not being a thing? How do you do this? Wait. Ship explorer? All right, let's do the ship explorer then. You know what, what uh, why the audio reminds me of? This funny song called My Microphone is Broken. <laughs> Is it like, is it like one of those like comedy songs? Okay. Yeah, sorry, I was, I was trying to gather in my head. There's so many of them. I was trying to gather in my head the best way to explain this. Basically in the world, in the story of Odd Aesthetic, there is a, a character named Tomoko who forms this team of uh, essentially what do you call those? What What is Batman like? Uh, vigilantes. It's a team of vigilantes who like to put it in simple terms without explaining how this is the society of this world works. They fight crime or something that that's like the Cliff Notes expo uh, explanation. Um, And, and, uh, so basically this right here is the team's home base. This is where they spend most of their time. It is also, it's called the Tomomobile. 
uh, for two reasons. One, because it is named after her. You can see the little T, that's your logo. And two, because it's slightly hard to pronounce, and that's really annoying for the villains. <laughs> uh, we're, we'll start with here. So this is the command deck. Um, oh shoot. Oh, uh, no, are you serious? It's one of these. Uh, everything's frozen, man. I, I don't know how, how much of that was actually said. There we go. I love when characters uh, fight crime or something. <laughs> I don't know how much of that was cut off when everything froze, but I I hope hopefully you heard. It's fine on my man. Oh, you heard everything? Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, I, I guess that's fine. Whenever uh, the stream freezes, I can't tell if like it froze for everyone else, but like, <clears throat> like I don't know if if anyone could like actually hear what I'm saying while it's frozen, that's the problem. Anyway, so this is the command deck, this is where uh, the ship is controlled. Uh, I kind of changed it since I made it here, because um, how it is designed now, <clears throat> it's more like a VR setup. It's like, there's ba it's basically like a spear, and then you get inside the spear and there's a bunch of buttons and stuff. But it's meant to be like, Extent. Uh, sorry. It's essentially an extension of you. Right down here through the, the pearly gates is what they're called. I don't know, I just made that up. My webtoon is kind of like that sort of. Oh, you got a webtoon! Oh, I didn't know that. Um. What's it called? <laughs> Anyways, this right here is essentially the meeting room. I like the clear color boxes. Oh yeah, yeah, um, they're meant to be, okay, these, this is meant to be a window. These are just meant to be, uh, holograms. But it's, you know, it's Minecraft, you kind of got to interpret it and stuff. This is meant to be, like, the globe. Like, this is the world right here. <clears throat> but it can display pretty much anything. There's, like, TV screens, but they're holograms. Is that the toilet in the clear boxes for the bad design tone? No, uh, <laughs> I just put water there because it looked fitting, I guess. This right here is the most complex character, I'd say. Um, this is Boo. He is a ball of slime, ball, a sentient ball of slime. He's essentially like the mascot character. And he's the most important. Barely any audio freeze. Oh, okay. That's good then. I boo the ball slime. Yeah, he's uh, probably the fan favorite uh, amongst like five people who are fans. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and go right down here. So here is the lounge. Get out of here. I don't want you here. Go. Die. <laughs> oh, if you haven't noticed uh, already, it's kind of meant to seem like kind of like a vape. It's kind of meant to have a vaporwave vibe. You might be able to tell better from this kind of flooring. It's kind of it has it has like a floral shop type feel. But anyways, um So yeah, this is the lounge area. This is like a couch. Well, it is a couch actually. And that's like the TV where they like you know, they can watch TV or they can like play games or something, I don't know. Uh whatever they do. Um, I wouldn't exactly call the, the cast of Autostack gamers or anything. Uh, here's the kitchen slash bar. They sit here, they eat. There's actually like a system set up. Because this is a, uh, an airship that is meant to, um, fly around at high speeds, there's like kind of a system to where basically nothing is allowed to be lying around. Everything kind of has to be locked up at all times. Um... Because, you know, an emergency situation could pop up at any time, so, you know, you gotta, like, keep things to where either they are able to be enclosed or, like, they're... It would be easy to, like, put them in there, essentially. 
I haven't made it yet, but I plan to call it on way. Interesting. Well, good luck on your endeavors. That's smart. I wouldn't have thought of that. Oh yeah, I, I've been writing this whole thing since I was like eight. So I have had quite the amount of time to think about the lore and all that. Um, let's go ahead. I don't know uh, where to go first. Let's go here first. Let's go downstairs. I'd be the idiot there with all my belongings sitting out and sliding over. Yeah, that does happen a few times, but eventually everyone kind of adjusts. This, oh yeah, this is the engine. Uh, it's not here at the moment. Liminal, liminal space house. Uh. <laughs> um, oh, here's a little interesting. So, okay. Uh... Nice. I'll go ahead and explain it after this. I'll just give you all a bit to look around. Your nerves are from you. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> it's funny, so it's fine. <laughs> oh! Whoa, hold up, hold on, no, no, no. Uh. This is important, everyone. First off, I'm gonna play a different song. Uh, this one's good. Let's play Kudere. Uh, we got a hat, uh, beep, 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 er, 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 er. We have a hat redeemed by Tree Sauce, and he says he wants the Obey hat. He already knows. He already already knows what he wants. And we're gonna we're gonna give it to him. Hats. Uh, as requested. There we go. How many hats are there? Uh, wait, hold on. Let me pull it up in a second. Gotta. <laughs> ah, uh, I look so stupid. <laughs> This and, you know, the blunt, you know. <laughs> uh, I, wait, let me try something real quick. I'm going to... Transform. Flip horizontal. There we go. That's better. Who <laughs> like classic? Uh... <laughs> It fits. It does. Uh, let me show it real quick. We have the Obey hat, the Top hat, the Get Smoked hat, Jester hat, Jotaro hat, Propeller hat, Charmex hat, and a Wizard hat. So like eight, I think. I haven't counted. Yeah, it's like eight. Okay, anyways. Yeah, let's... Okay, so... As I stated before, there have been a lot and a lot and a lot and a lot of changes to Autostatic over the years. Many changes. Uh, and that starts here. These are meant to be representations of like the costume designs because they all have, um... <laughs> Speaking of fashionista, they all have, um, distinct costumes for like the superheroing. This is Jakku. Originally his name was Diamond because uh, his powers, uh, it's in relation to his powers, essentially his skeleton is made up of a diamond-like substance. Not actual diamonds, just diamond-like substance. So he's called Diamond. Um, that's not his name anymore. Now he's given the name Future Funk. It's all Vaporwave subgenre titles. This one's X, this was for Armex the robot. Um, who is now called Broken Transmission. That's their, well, that's their co code name, superhero name, you know, I don't know. This was for Tomoko. Originally it was called, she was called Rainwaves. Now she's called, uh, I have to think what, well, I kind of forget hers a lot. It's like, it's like Dark Vaporwave or something. Uh. Hard Vapor, that's right. Because her whole thing is that um, she's invisible like Vapor, but hits 
hard or something like that. That's like her slogan. Uh, this one over here was Stratosphere. Uh, this is for Aurora. Obviously, in, in relation to her... Um, oh, yeah, well, for Tomoko, this is in relation to her um, genius intellect, her 420 uh, IQ. Uh, Aurora had, like, electric slash magnetic power, so Stratosphere was fitting. I expected one of them to be Nightcore. One of them used to be called Nightcore, and then I changed it. And we'll get to him in a second. Actually, he's literally right here. Um, this one uh, uh, is now called Moe Shop, which is interesting in a sense. Because, you know, all the other ones are based off more genres, but Moe Shop is an actual, like, artist. Uh, but I, I just think the genre, the, the type of music that Moe Shop makes, um, as well as, like, the name itself, really just fits her character. And that's more so kind of what I'm trying to match here. The vibe of the music I'm trying to match with the actual, like, characters. Because Jakku is a very future funk-esque character. Tomoko is really dark and hardcore, so she's uh, uh, hard vapor. Armex is constantly glitching because he's a broken robot, therefore broken transmission. This is so cool, thank you. And then we get over to Quiver, who's essentially like the Flash. Now, originally their name was Nightcore because Nightcore songs the main idea is that it's just a normal song, but sped up. But then I decided to change it, and this is actually fairly recently. I decided to change it because Nightcore itself isn't exactly Vaporwave, and neither is this other one, but I feel like it kind of fits better. For Ada Ada, no, Ado Adora, or Aurora, however you want to say it. <laughs> I guess it does kind of sound like I said that, but I didn't, I promise. But yeah, he's a speedster. Um, but he's not called Nightcore, he is called Breakcore, which is pretty similar in name. But it's also like a style of music that's super like uh, fast, but I feel like um, Breakcore is a lot more. There's like more of an emphasis on like the drums. Like going like, or something like that. It's like a little bit more electric sounding, which fits the sci-fi feel a little better. So that's why I went with that. And then we have Tank. Um, they went through a lot of changes, as well as Portal Girl. But we'll we'll get to her in a second. Uh, Tank is now called um, Mallsoft. Um, <laughs> thanks for that, my ears. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> But yeah, Tank, as the name implies, I had a hard time naming him, so I just called him Tank for, as like a placeholder name. But he's like the tank of the group. Essentially, his abilities is that um, whenever he gets hurt, his uh, whatever part of him that got hurt essentially just becomes stronger. It's like that whole thing, like what doesn't kick makes you stronger. But it's like... You know, like, if you hit your hand on something and it swells? It's like that, but it swells into, like, this grotesque, muscular thing. So, like, a lot of the times what he does, he'll just, like, slam his arm up against the wall, and then it'll become large. <laughs> and he'll just use that. That So, basically, he's got super strength, but it's, like, self-inflicted harm super strength. So, like, Deku from My Hero Academia is, like, kind of... A comparison I use a lot, but it's like a little different, obviously. Um, and his actual name, wait, say Arda Arda in a stone. <laughs> Arda Arda. <laughs> I don't know. I, that's the, that's my, that's my stoner voice. Hitting my hand is my favorite music genre. Oh yeah, the music genre. Ma yeah, music genre is Malsoft. Um, because he's like the type that's like, um, you know, like the lovable brute type character who's like you know he's super big and buff but he's like a huge softy it's like that but most of the time he's not even like huge 
He's actually like super uh, like thin and malnourished looking because of how he was treated before he um, uh, found this group. Um, but of course, like when he is inflicted with pain, he becomes large, like a giant, like beast, essentially. Oh, and, but his actual name is Pisces um, because he comes from the b aforementioned Zodiac group, which all of their names are based off a certain Zodiac. Uh, anyways, this is Portal Girl. Uh, her actual name is Porta uh, Solitoire, which is French for lonely. Um, she's like, she's, she's basically, um, oh, where's Capricorn? I forgot which one was, uh, I do have like all of the, uh, the characters listed out. Um, but at the point that Tank, uh, sorry, Pisces joins the team, uh, all the other ones are basically, they're either dead or arrested. <laughs> um, so I don't know what happens with Capricorn. No, I remember which one Capricorn was, but I'm not going to get into it. Uh, Portal Girl is essentially a girl that makes portals. Think like Chell from Portal or Portal 2. She can just be like, wha-bam, uh, and just like shoot a portal out of her hand, shoot another one there, there you got portals. Um, but uh, it's also like one of those things where... See, what I like to do with uh, power systems is I like there to be like, it's sort of like a risks versus reward slash thing. Is the music loud enough, by the way? I keep looking over. Oh no, I closed it. Oops, I'll, I'll get another one. But yeah, I, I like doing this thing where it's like, oh, this power is useful, but it has a drawback sort of thing. And a lot of it has to do with like, Essentially just pain. Yeah, gentle giant. But, um... With her, essentially, she just suffers, like, mild nausea. And stuff like that. Sorry, I was distracted for a second. Um... Yeah, this is the same song, by the way. It's just done differently. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah, her genre is slush wave uh, because she's generally really lazy. Um, which, like, I kind of uh, contribute or associate a slush wave with, like, feeling lazy. Or not exactly lazy, but just sort of, like, sluggish. Like, you're just sort of like... Ooh. If that makes sense. Like the type of feeling that you feel when you're tired and you don't feel like doing anything. That's kind of what I think Slush Wave feels like to me. So that's hers. Then we have Omega Unihuman, now called Omega Unikeros. And also he's not part of the team anymore. He's just a side character that showed up once. I've never heard of Slush Wave. Oh, okay. It's basically like, think like, okay. Take a song, right? Uh, slow it down significantly. Add tons of reverb and repetitions, and you basically got slush wave. It's like this sort of like, like kind of sounding song. It's very, think like a slushy, but it's music. <laughs> um, but anyway, since he's not part of the team, he doesn't have uh, a music. The only people in Autostatic who have uh, names based on vaporwave subgenres are the main characters and the main like villains for the season. Because there are like main villains, but they're also not like main characters, so they don't have it. But like the main, there's at least one main villain per season who has like a vaporwave name. And then we have. Uh, shoot, that's a spoiler. Don't look at that. And then we have stylized. That's not how you spell it. Um, I'm also not going to explain that one. That one's like, 
It's fine. <laughs> I don't want anyone knowing yet. Um, this is the mech that Tomoko used to save Jakku that one time, and she uses it other times too. Um, this is Tomoko's workshop. This is where she does her little inventions, her little little knickknacks, little little whatever. Uh, spends a lot of time here sulking. And that is the basement. Now, uh, we have the hallway. This is where all the characters stay. And look, I na- Oh, I, uh, I guess I updated these. To have their actual names, because look at that, Hard Vapor. At some point, I called R RMX Vape Error, which is a subgenre. But I decided not to because it's too close to Hard Vapor. And also, these are kind of in order of, you know, it's a first come, first serve. Slow plus reversing. It's not specifically... I guess it should be more specific. It's not so much that it's slow plus reverb. That's more vaporwave in general. Or... I guess it's not, but but that more refers to vaporwave. Uh, slush wave, on the other hand, is like that times 10. To the point that you cannot, like, comprehend what you're hearing. But anyways, um, these rooms... I plan to make a liminal space game. Ooh! Cool. These rooms are put in order of, like, whoever joined the team first. So obviously Tomiko started it, she gets the first room here. Armex uh, was the second because uh, Tomiko discovered him and brought him in. Jakku was the third, and we see this happen during the first episode. And there he is, Future Funk. Ah, okay, I guess at some point I called her Floral Shop. But she is uh, now called... Uh, not that, uh, Moe Shop. And I, oh, I forgot to mention her last name. It's Aurora Magneta, uh, Tomoko Ray. I probably said Jack and Meta at some point. Um, that is not right at all. I'm taking that out of the way. That's not right either. That's not right. That is definitely not right. <laughs> this is completely wrong. Oh, that one's right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just ignore those. It's all retcons, don't worry. This is the bathroom. Now, I know what you're thinking. What a weird uh, concept. Uh, you have the bath right here. There's not even, like, a door here. You have the bath right here. Like, clearly, like, someone could just, like, look in, right, while you're taking a bath. And also, like, if the ship is flying super fast, water's just gonna spill out. Here's the deal. You press a button, uh, beep, beep, burp. Um, essentially a wall shows up. Uh, that, it's like a one-way mirror type thing. So it's like, it's a wall from this side, but you can see through it from this side. Or you can make it, like, completely not transparent and just not be able to see from the other side. You can do that too. Um, anyways, you can come in here. Uh, there was a toilet here, um, but I changed it with the floor so it's gone now and there's a secret room this is not canon i just put this here for fun secret room yep and there uh used to be a lever there as well which went all the way back out here to the front of the ship and it opens this door where you get nothing there's nothing in here but yeah, that's the Tomo Mobile. Oh, that thing up there is meant to be like a sail. It's kind of like a pirate ship, but yeah. Now, with all that being said, let's get back to building. <laughs> is, do you guys want to see a tour of the Zodiac ship as well? So this is actually a building that can transform into a ship, but... This is it during building form. It's shaped like a Z because it's a zodiac. Uh, you got floor. Uh, what does this say? There's uh, this is the control room with for Ares, who is the uh, the leader. 
And there's a bunch of other stuff. Uh, this meant to be a small version, and then I would build that to scale, but I never did. That's it, that, there's your tour. Ugh, sorry if I spend too long in that kind of stuff. I just like talking. I mean, it, I, it is a stream, I guess, so you gotta gotta talk during your streams. Oh. Mm, we've been going for an hour, guys. All right, what's, what, what should I build next? Y'all, tell, tell me. Tell me. I'll try to think of ideas as well. Actually, while I wait, I got I got one. That was cool. Thank you. Uh, just just my lifelong dream is all, you know, you know how it is. It is literally, by the way, you know, okay, because I, I joke a lot and stuff, but, but like that, making like odd aesthetic into like an actual like franchise sort of thing. That actually is like my lifelong dream. Like I've literally been obsessed with making that uh, a reality for the past uh, however many years. is going. There we go. That's good. Yay! I made a hat. Woohoo! Uh, I think the brim. You guys remember when Yankee with no brim was like the funniest thing in the world? And I laughed every time I heard someone say it. That was cool. Let's get rid of this brim. Well, that, well, that's meant to be more like the back of the head. <sighs> Great. I don't know what that is. It's the Obey hat! Look at it. I, I made a little uh, inappropriate little uh, shape there. I, I hope you guys don't mind. Um, here, I'm going to try to rebuild this place. Oh no, why is it catching on fire? I don't get it. This doesn't make sense. Hmm. Um, does anyone wanna see? <laughs> it just looks like a big flame. Would anyone be interested? Here, I'm gonna put out the fire. 
You wanna put out the fire, guys? What does it look like a... Uh, I don't know what you're saying in this hat. Oh no! I gotta put more wool here to get rid of the fire. That's actually just meant to be like a Y. Like, if, you know, you've turned your head to the left. You'll see it's a... The letter Y. I don't know. Uh, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't get why this is burning, by the way. This doesn't make sense. Anyways, my idea. Uh, would you like to see... Would anyone out there like to see me build a, um... Uh, a TNT launcher in Minecraft, specifically? I think it would be fun. I've seen a long Mickey Mouse face. Wait. <laughs> sure. Uh. I don't get why this doesn't burn. Jeez. This makes me sad. You hate to see it. Alright, I got a yes please in the chat. I guess that's what we're doing now. Uh, but first, let me just caught just a little bit of chaos. Uh, what did I just... What? Excuse me? Oh, no, 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 no. What do you call that? What was it? Since we get... You know, you deserve to die. And I, 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 oh no, oh no, look what's happened, uh oh, uh oh, you've lived too long, buddy. I'm gonna make a ring of fire. <laughs> yeah! You deserve that. Let's go, let's go cause genocide. Guys, I think it'd be fun, wholesome. Okay, you know what, this is a good place to build, <laughs> this is a good place to build my TNT launcher. <laughs> okay, I'm marking my spot. Uh, this is fine. Um, <clears throat> okay, if I remember correctly, this is how you build it. <laughs> you get T. Uh, uh, I did the ice bucket challenge. Uh, I mean, I did do that. I did that like uh, six years ago, though. Uh, I'd like eight years ago, actually. Okay, we're gonna need. Actually, we're gonna need a lever. We're gonna need. Uh, actually, let's make it a button. Stone button. I guess we can make a polish flex some button as well. Um, yeah, I don't know why his head was moving. That was weird. Quite possibly the uh, weirdest thing I've seen in this whole game, actually. Quite pos oh, What is going on in the background? Jeez. What is that? What's going on there? Crazy. Okay. Uh, you need TNT, obviously. I don't know how I forgot that. Um, you don't need to obey hat parts. Don't worry about that. Uh, water. You need water. That's right. Okay. So, if I remember correctly, and I might need to look this up. Make it somewhere uh, around this length. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I got it. Um, just in case, though, I'm gonna put some stuff in here. It doesn't have to look classy, it just has to look. Good. Okay. <clears throat> you put water here, right? <laughs> and then it does exactly what you didn't want it to do. Um, oh, is that the limit? Oh, I guess so. Is it though? Okay. What you're gonna want to do, and I would advise you do this. What? Well, okay, essentially what you're doing is you're just you're just going around like this. Um, 
mayhaps I'll put that there just for fun uh, and then what you're gonna want to do is you know, put together a little thing here I actually you just need one in fact I don't know why I even put these things here we don't need those yet um, we actually just need this and I guess I could test it real quick. Okay, that is how that works. Cool. Oh, gotta restock it now. Oh, no, I don't. That's right, because it's in water. Um, To see these uh, these idiots burn. It's gonna be great. We just need one final ingredient. All right, we're gonna need a little bit more than that. Uh, actually, I believe this should be this. There we go. Okay. My calculate. My calculations are correct. This should work. Watch this. Watch it go. Yes! Yes! It didn't work last time I did it. Uh... Oh shoot! <laughs> That's not supposed to happen. Okay. Uh, that's okay. Let us instead severely delay this. Something akin to this. Fire in a hole. Okay. Now watch. Yeah, it didn't go as far as I wanted. Uh, let's just do arson. This sounds more fun. Yeah! Woo! -hoo! Yeah, baby! That's what I'm talking about. Woo! -hoo. Don't set fire to my buildings, by the way. Um, just don't do that. It's fun hearing them cry. You know what they say. Um, actually, I don't know what they say. I don't think there's a saying that relates to. Oh, uh, now this is just done. This is not really doing a good job at killing them off at all. I mean, a few of them. Yeah, yeah. I wanted the majority of them to die. Well, it's welcome, content revive, aka Cynthia, aka I think you're going under under a new name now. I forgot. Uh, can someone explain to me how this happened? Are we just gonna ignore this? Bro, Atlas partnered with a uh, mouthwash company for the Persona 25th anniversary. Yo! Mouthwash and Persona 6. Okay, look, I'm just gonna get rid of the water if you like it that much. Go! Move! There. Die. Is that Luigi? Uh... Somewhere. Yeah, 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 actually, yeah. Fire! I'm sorry, everyone. Time set the day. There we go. Now you can see your brother's burn better. Okay, you know, I need mass destruction. I just need these things to die, right? So, like, look at it from my perspective, okay? 
what would you do if you needed, if, y yeah, you would, um, spawn some wizards around and, and get them to do all the work. I haven't been in a Twitch chat in so long. Me neither, actually. I haven't watched Twitch in a while. OMG, Twitch. I'm so sorry. Don't, uh, punish me by making me more obscure. Oh, no. Because I said that. Where's the, um, the things? Which is... Vindicators? Which one's like the the anti we'll we'll go with Vindicators for now. I thought it was like I thought they were called like pillagers. Though. Oh no, yeah, they are. Oh oh Vindicators like the wizard, okay. may relate to the fact that I'm in peaceful mode. All right. Oh, this isn't the wizard. This is, this is the... Whatever. <laughs> it is nice to be in a Twitch. Oh, I spend my time playing RPG games for long periods of time until I die and lose that time and stop playing it for a month. Interesting. Now this is what you like to see. Total global annihilation. This is war, guys. Isn't it beautiful? You are making the omelet of all mothers, Jack. Oh, those creepers. Hey, guys. Well, I didn't think that would happen. What was that? What did I get? I got iron. Oh, cause that guy died. Well, oh well. Oh no, oh, you almost ruined my sign, dude. You shouldn't do that. <laughs> Can I set fire to these guys? How easy do you kill? <laughs> Yo, look at all this iron I'm farming. This is great. Why don't people normally do this? <laughs> I'm sorry, I felt out, wait. I fell out for a bit. I'm sick right now and so fell asleep. But not because of you, I'm sorry. Oh, uh, don't worry about it. If you, if you, if you need a rest, say go ahead and rest. I do need to sleep though, so take care of it. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Have, have a good, have a good sleep. And, well, I guess I should say have a good night. <laughs> it would make more sense. Yeah, I killed him! Ah, oh, this is exactly what I wanted. Wait, why are they dead? That's a nice argument. Senator, why don't we back it up with the source? Um, omelets are all what? THESE TWO ARE CONVERSING! <laughs> oh, just for that, you get one more, at least one more. Actually, you get a pillager. Uh, you get both, actually. <laughs> Ominous banner. Um... We need more destruction. Uh, let's get some... Be I mean, witches. <laughs> Forget the obsidian stuff. Uh, what's the diamond mean? Does that mean like Dantium the diamond minecart? OMG, hey everyone, Dan- Hello everyone! I don't remember what he sounds like. <laughs> uh, I get some vexes. Yeah, I wanted the stupid wizard guy, whatever his name is. What is he called? What is a strider? <laughs> Squid games. Ravagers, I think that's what it's called. Oh, no wait, we got pillagers. Or was that, oh, I don't know actually.
Not a phantom. Wait, Evoker, that's like a Persona reference. Hold on. Alright. Oh, now these two are conversing. Great, you you're useless. Ah, oh, that's what you are. What's wrong, dude? You need some water? Dude, just drink the water. It's not that hard. Drink the water. water. Well, why did he die? You're the stray. Oh, we're in games. <laughs> Squid games. Are you shaking? Are you like cold or something? Stop complaining. Mm -hmm. Oh, they did a little Tom and Jerry thing. That's cute. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Whoa, what happened here? It really is war. Someone's dying, I don't know. <laughs> All this death around here. Oh, uh, death and destruction, you know how it is. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, thank you for the re Ah, thank you for the redeem. Okay, wait, I got an idea. Thanks for the water. Oh, uh, Cynthia. Uh, you know what? Tribute to you, Cynthia. I got something for you. A little, little surprise. Okay. C. Why? Uh, why? That's how you spell it, right? Yeah. <laughs> N. Hey, hey, don't die yet. I'm not done. <laughs> What the frick, man? Oh, what the heck, dude? Oh, they moved too. That's stupid. How do you guys keep spawning? Are you, like, evolving? Hey, you keep triggering. Or did they spawn because it's, like, kind of dark here and there's a water? I'm gonna lag my game. Which is, uh, ah, yeah, this little ghost guys, Whee. fly away little fairies, ah, that's what you guys are, what are you cold too, not complaining, where's the, um, where's the guy, hey, don't push me, Where's the ones that's like... Ooh, uh, these can kill off the skeletons. Um... Where's the one that's like a big... Hey! The one that's like... It's one of the pillagers. But he's like an animal? Hybrid? I think it's a Ravager. What? I have Ravager. What is the Ravager? Oh, that is what I wanted, yeah. More of these, please. They're really adorable, I think. What is this? Oh, not the shulkers. I don't want the <laughs> Yeah, run for your lives! That's just a squid. Don't point that at me. <laughs> no! Don't hurt him! You didn't do anything wrong, did you, buddy? And you're, you're these guys. Uh, I actually wanted a freaking dog, so, like, if you could just get one of those, that'd be good. Yeah. Oh, oh puppies. That's why the Squid Games died. Yeah, it's kind of cool. That reference to when Cynthia died five minutes ago from eating too many sponges. Yeah. Oh, that was the reference. <laughs> and die. Oh, you're already dead, actually. 
This is how it happened. This is how this is how the Squid Games died. Let's just get stoned real quick. <laughs> I'm stoned with facts and knowledge. I don't know what I'm saying. I, maybe I am high. I don't know. I'm pretty sure my brain like automatically releases like like drugs, just like on its own like I just have like I just have like like meth or something or, or just like that just secretes into my brain I, I I don't know there's something wrong with me um you just look at me you can't do that you know Bye bye. There's no one else light on fire, dude. Uh, you guys are gonna die. These guys burn? That's cool. Bye, doggy. My choppa's going after the anti SpongeBobbers. Oh, we got. Okay. We got. We got. We got. We got to deal with this meta drip. Now, how am I gonna do Metatrip? Questions. I guess for years. Um, I guess it can fit. Yeah, that works. It actually works better than how it did before because I'm not moving. <laughs> like, at all. Oh, but I, I did want to just, like... Bye guys. All right. Uh, yeah, I guess let's uh, take care of the dogs. Wait. Okay. Let's see if it works now. At no. Oh. Uh, um. At uh, kill. No. Oh, it's gonna be me. Kill. Cool. Did I just see? He's still shaking his head, like, no, please. And then I don't let's set fire to that. Let's set fire to it, idiot. Jeez. The stupid dogs are still alive. What the heck? Let them. Just let them. It's their own. It, just let them. Tell you what I'm gonna do. This has been my lifelong dream for uh, since I was a child. I know I said it before, but this is my actual lifelong dream. Just build a treehouse in Minecraft. Which I, I did. Okay. You want to hear a sad story? Let's get on. Let's get a, a little bit more of a. Um, a sad song of sorts. Okay. There we go. Okay. Turn it up for you guys. When I was a child, I, um, you know, one thing I, I liked, I, I wanted to build was a tree house. Just a nice... A little tree house complete with like you know rooms and stuff like a, like a jungle tree house right every time I built one in Minecraft it always you know something went wrong um <sighs> but today we're gonna change all that we're gonna make the 
Best of dang tree house you could ever think of. We're gonna need some materials for that. First, let's start with the base. Okay, looking pretty strong there. Uh, something like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just gonna get a little random with it. It's Minecraft after all. I'm gonna be. Super, uh. Whatever with it. There we go. Okay. Branch. Okay. We'll go back and fix stuff later. I just want to make this real quick. Okay. There we go. Okay. Okay. Uh, we got something going. Okay. Um, we have like a little, a little spiral staircase actually. Uh, we could actually do something a little counter-intuitive, uh, or counterculture, if you will. Have it go backwards. Isn't that cool? Uh, and yeah, we'll just, like, do something like this. Maybe, like, put a wall here. If we, you know, if we really wanted to, we could. It's like a like tree branch wrapped around it, so it's like we don't really need that, you know. Oh, we. Uh, sorry, I actually did see this before. I just didn't read it. Um, weed logs. Okay, so I'm a hundred and two weeds in. I can barely. Type raw, please help us with 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 blah. Yeah, basically me right now. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's put some freaking trees on this thing, dude. Uh, leaves. I mean to say, why would I put trees on trees? It's stupid. Possibly the stupidest idea I've ever heard. But keep that just in case. Um, yeah, coarse dirt would be nice. Um, okay. Yep. Yep, yeah, I'm feeling it. Yep, okay. Yep. Yeah, okay. This is looking good. I'm feeling it, you know? It's pretty good. Craftsmanship. Yeah, I, you know, I was being ironic. This actually doesn't look that well. Like maybe like this part, um, but like <laughs> it's authentic. It's what trees look like in real life. Don't end, stupid song. There's more time. You got more time to fill, dude. Freaking, uh, start over, man. Do it, do, do it. Loop, uh, or something. Here we got a shower, all right. Have a successful time, I don't know. Okay, cool. Okay, now, this is cool now, but what is a tree house? Like, okay, it's cool and all, but it seems a little incomplete. What is it missing? More trees, that's right. Um, I say we build off of this. It's essentially, like, cause think about this, you know, if you got a tree, why not just make a tree farm? Like, wouldn't that just be like, like the next step of evolution, basically? Freaking tree farm in the trees. And that's what we're gonna do. Um, we need. Mm, what is that stuff? Bone meal. 
Oh, I need to put the <laughs> I need to put the saplings on it first. That's right. When people tell you don't put trees on your treehouse, they're just haters. Don't listen to them. There we go. What I tell you, it works. Obviously. No one believes me. Look, I made it work. Look at that. Jungle on a uh, jungle. Jungle. I'm within the tree. We got a quitter over here, I guess. Uh, in my survival world, I've been building a big tower <clears throat> out of everything, and the part I've been working on has been has a bunch of trees sticking out of it. <laughs> cool, dude. All right. No, this is this isn't working. This is not. Okay, that one works, but. I, it's just missing something, you know? It's just... What is it missing? Maybe... If I may, you know, maybe I gotta cover up that area. Just for aesthetics. You know, it's not... It, it's not as fulfilling as I assumed it would be. Uh, it's just like... You know, I got one of those like ideas like forming in my brain uh, and it's currently in its current state um, says something along the lines of more trees. So I think we'll start there. Um, yeah, 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 no, you're right. I should add more. I'm thinking um, something like this, you know, a four. We've seen enough, you know, like we can add more, I guess, but we've basically seen, we've seen all that one by ones have to offer. I think this is the age of, of two by twos. What did I say? Four by four? Yeah, no, 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 no. This song make just make you feel warm inside and outside. Doesn't make you feel like it like it's basically a heat stroke. Oh yes. Oh yeah, that's good. That's the good stuff. But of course, you know, every every piece of art has its critics. Gotta account for them. Could always shake things up and go a bit, a little, a little bit quirkly and put some different kinds of trees. You know, I was thinking that, and I was thinking that that might be just like the dumbest idea I've ever thought of. But, but then you said it, and then I thought, you know what? It doesn't sound too bad. So I, I might consider, <laughs> I might consider something like that. In fact, uh, I was lying. It's actually genius. And I did think of that, so in a way, I'm kind of a <laughs> genius. So. <laughs> what is this stupid persona I'm putting on? Okay. Uh, <laughs> so that, like every like third sentence I say is just something really dumb. Okay, that's good, that's cool. Uh, yeah, I say we do that. We got, we got Hoke, Pruce, Urch, Mungle, Acadia, Dark Broke, some, well, well. What about the, uh, you know, the, uh, the, these? Do you need the roots? How do you get the, uh, 
Um, the satanic trees. How do you get those? Use some spore blossoms for now. You can't grow them. What? Mojang, Mojang, Microsoft, whatever. Fix your game. Fix your horrible, stupid, awful game. I hate it. I hate Minecraft. It's awful. I don't know why I play it. Only spawn naturally near there. Well, doesn't that just sound utterly moronic for a game about blocks? Like, I don't think I've heard a stupider idea in my entire life. Okay, but let's just, like, you know, let's just... Dark oak. Yeah. Uh... Urch, Bruce, I don't remember the names I gave these things. Yeah, it's just go crazy. Put another one there, yeah. Uh, Why? Well, I, I wouldn't say that. That's, you know, maybe don't be too crazy. Yeah, I guess yeah, you could put another picture. And you know, there's an over influx of jungle trees. We could put one more there, though. Uh, and there, and there, uh, and. Uh, 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 maybe put another acacia there, um, and then maybe, uh, consider putting, uh, another birch, and then, uh, you might actually want to consider maybe, like, putting another spruce there, uh, but then, like, maybe put, like, an oak there, uh, and then, like, uh, oh, Jesus, this is hard, um, yeah, okay, that was stressful, oh, yeah, baby, Oh, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I thought that one wasn't gonna work. The, oh, that was a stretch. I didn't think it was gonna work. Um, oh, whew. literally, not. <laughs> George Orwell's book, 1984, basically. Looking at the high, high, per. Sorry, could you say that again? Uh, hyper probability of the situation. This is turning out to be quite the studious plant. Yeah. Why? Well, it's meant to be a tree house. This isn't a tree house. This is like a. This is a tree nightmare. <clears throat> I mean, like. I mean, like. I don't want to offend nobody or anything, but like, this is the word. I'm not feeling it. I'm just not feeling it. What is it missing? It's missing something. Like, yeah, okay. You know, we look back on it. We, we, you know, we grow all the trees, but then, but then like what, what? We just grow more trees? We just grow more trees? I say, we put some house on this tree house. What do you guys think? Tartars! <laughs> it's Tartars. It's exactly like Tartars. Okay. Look. I know I'm full of crazy ideas, but I'm thinking. Just... Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna close my eyes and just let the music guide me. Okay. My eyes are closed. I'm letting the the wind take me now. I don't hear block placement anymore, did I? Okay, I'm opening my eyes. Where did I go? Oh, oh, okay. Build stairs and a bunch of different floors, and at the top, make an arena. Yes! Brilliant! Alright, here's the arena. I combine the rooms with the trees. Uh, I, I like this advent guard idea. And I, I think Yeah. 
That's what. Ew! I can taste that like in real life. That's awful. I'm staying up here. How far does that reach, by the way? It goes all the way down here. I hope you guys breathe this in and like get sick or something. Welcome back. Uh, weed sauce. Oh, we didn't come up with a name. Uh, <laughs> content weed vibed. Is that's your name? I've been coming up with weed equivalents for everyone's names. So we have uh, weed sauce and content weed vibed. Since this is an arena, we're gonna need uh, some challengers. Yeah. Alright, uh. Mushroom, yeah? Evoker. I forgot what those are. G gas could be fun, yeah. Blunt Stegia. Okay, that one's a little better. Ah, but it's like, you know, read, revive, weed vibe, you know what I mean? Zombie horse. Where's. Oh, yeah, I didn't. I want the skeleton horses. I'll give him, like, armor to accommodate for a skin. A salmon? Yeah? They're pretty fierce. Oh! What the heck, dude? Oh, so that was the wizard. Wait. That was the wizard I was trying to spawn. Hey, get back down there. I need you to kill some people. I don't know what his problem was. But whatever. Yeah, because he... I'm pretty sure... The wizards are the guys with the hats. Let's get some blazes. Alright, hey, hey, don't fight yet. I just want, uh... Why did they die? <laughs> uh, this <laughs> is like Charles Darwin, uh, stuff right there. Um... Skeleton horse, skeleton horse, skeleton horse. You all... Oh, it won't let me do it. Oh well. Summon to the rescue! Hey, come back, come back, come back. <laughs> We're not done yet. <laughs> Content rehide. Yeah, let's get some phantoms. Oh, sorry guys. I'll make it daytime for you. That might be better. Oh, there we go. Now we got some fighting going on. Oh. What are they shooting at? Hold on. Something happened. I don't know. Well, I guess they just didn't want to be forced into... Oh, no, no, here we go. We got something going on. <laughs> Raining puffer fish. Dude, this is the loot drops. Uh...
Where's the one that's like, um...
I would argue, just because, you know, it's like, like, this is so cliche, right? Uh, uh, like, like, to have, like, a uh, staircase, as well as, you know, if we had, like, a waterfall, like, that's so, like, everyone's seen the classic Minecraft waterfall. I think it would be cooler if we did, like, a lava one, would you say? I think that would be pretty neat. It's a little hard to place it here. Um, on account of the water. Uh, but we're, we seem to be doing good with that. Alright, and then, yeah, they can basically... Because you can, like, swim up lava like you do with water, right? So I think that'll work out well. This guy just will never... Uh, unique egg, buddy. <laughs> I'm just gonna spawn them under the lava. Uh. Oh, it's 11. Yeah, I guess we should, like, stop streaming at some point. Oh, you guys are used to that. You don't care. <laughs> hey, kid. <laughs> oh, no, kid, watch out. Oh, no. Oh, he's one. Oh, he's one. <laughs> the kid died because he flailed his big, stupid arms in his face. Uh, what happened here, man? <laughs> I just love that. He smacks him in the head. The lava didn't kill him. He smacked him in the head, and that's what killed him. At least this guy's doing okay. I don't know why he survived. Uh, let's just get down. I want to see the inside of it. Now, doesn't that look cool? Like, you know, it's like... Oh, we got survivors. I will survive. Yeah. Good job on surviving. Oh, so that just literally doesn't hurt. Okay, why? I don't know why it hurts the other guys. Hey, man. You did a good job. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 you did. <laughs> that is not what I expected. No, I think this kid did die. He's just going to heaven. Hey, yeah, give it a bit. It'll... Why? Well, I guess he went to hell. Um, anyways, I call this a work of art. Okay, now it looks like Tartarus. It actually looks more like Tartarus than it did before. Oh, uh, look at that. You know, it's like, it's like all destructive, ugh, evil. But then you go on the inside, it's like all peaceful. It's like a, you know, it's like a tree in here. Surrounded by a waterfall? Hey, this is, this is stuff. No, I'm not gonna destroy it. Why, why would I do that? I just let nature take its course. By the way, if you are wondering what happened to like my previous um like tree houses in Minecraft, basically this. I was trying to like pay tribute to them. Instead of like, <laughs> instead of like, you know, actually just building Alright, you know what, I think I will build that staircase, actually. What am I even, am I even doing? Oh, it's like a staircase. Yeah, wait. Okay, uh, yeah. Something like that. A clear way, man. I thought the fire was trying to get rid of the trees. Not... You know, okay, this is like floor three or something. Uh... Why are you pixelated? What do you mean, why am I pixelated? It's probably, probably your internet. Because that's not meant to happen. Uh, hi shovel me bro. Sorry, I don't know what that means, hi shovel me. Like, hi shovel, I don't know, uh, who's shovel? Me sending to the 420s uh, in the sky to the pungs. Hell yeah, 
grunge cake. Oh, grun yeah, grunge cake -ia. Thank you for the redeem. I was very thirsty. In fact, I was actually gonna die, uh, but you fed me water, so it's all good. By the way, welcome, grunge cake. Yeah. Welcome, grunge cake. Welcome. I just said that. Uh, how are you? Um. So high five the shovel. Oh, wouldn't that like hurt? If you high five the shovel. See, okay. So basically, some context for our newcomer here. Um, your voice is pixelated. That's not supposed to happen. Um, that actually is weird. Let me look at that for a second. Well, anyways, I'm building a tree house. That's all you need to know. Uh, if I go to, like, filters... Yeah, no, I, I, don't, I don't have any voice mods on. I don't know why. <laughs> you should burn the treehouse down, like, burn my dread, like, Persona 3, haha, <laughs> get it? But, like, why would I burn it down? That'd be kind of dumb. Like... No, I'm not gonna burn the treehouse down. That'd be stupid. It'd be funny? No. What do you think? Oh, oh, it's on fire. Oh, it's so, like, no, that's not cool, dude. It's already on fire. <laughs> you don't know that. Okay, parts of it are on fire. That doesn't mean anything. What a wasteland. Wee -wee. This is like an elevator. As I was saying, you know, I'm not gonna burn the treehouse down. You know? Like, you all say fire is funny. It's not funny, it's serious. You know, people die from this kind of stuff. Like, you know, forest fires and the like. It's not funny, it's a serious issue here. We don't make light, we don't make light of serious issues on this. shovels, right? It's not nice. It's mean. <laughs> Inflicting harm on somebody else. That's really rude. <laughs> I don't know what, why anyone would do such a thing. <laughs> oh no! Uh, they pushed me. That's like cruel. Well, you know, we gotta keep uh, this one. This area. Got this place. 
Yeah. Okay, we gotta build a kitchen or something. Just like a little something to remember it by. Oh yeah, we can play some music. The jukebox. Uh, oh, wait, we're gonna need some lighting, like some fire torches. Where's the, um, the music this? Oh yeah, yeah. First, I'll go here. Crafting table goes here. Uh, I could put some stuff there. I don't know what all this is about. Uh, jukebox could go there. Uh, yeah. And then. Minecraft dance party, let's go. And that is how I made the best treehouse in the whole world. Sorry, I had my thing in the way. Couldn't see the chat. Okay. What do you guys think? This slaps? Yeah. We hit shovel supposed to call it. What, you, what I'm saying is you're hitting each other with the shovels. joining me it's Minecraft journey oh yeah watch me dance I hope you all had a fun time I sure did uh, make sure you uh, uh, this is the outro by the way this is the outro follow me twitch all that um, you're probably seeing this through like a VOD or whatever so like um, <laughs> yeah, like the video if you like the video subscribe if you like subscribing um, and like you know all, uh, man, just like follow me on stuff and like listen to my music and like my art and, and, and all that. Like, dude, like, you get it, man. You watching this video right now, you get it. 
Yep, as Teresa said, happy 420, everyone. Um, yeah, high shovels all around. Let me get a shovel out. Give him a shovel. Give him a shovel out. Okay, thank you all for watching. Uh, have a good, have a good smoke. Smoke some weed, smoke copious amounts until you drop dead. And, uh, you may see me on the other side with you. Uh, and, yeah. Jaw, jaw meta. I gotta, like, you know, pause the game to, like, close the game out. But just pretend that I ended it right there, okay? Bye.